Oh, excuse me guys. Hey, it's Ruby here. Hoping to bring you a decent game here today on uh, a map I sometimes get to play. Sometimes I play it well, sometimes I don't. I want to see how Mr. Harris plays this map today. He is playing uh, Mr. Violet. Could be Mrs. Violetta. Not sure. And it's going to be the, the gravy train. I mean, the wreck train. Exactly. Yeah, so without further ado, I just thought I would uh, get ready to get this party going at five seconds. Let's see how Mr. Harris and the Warmark play Mr. Violetta. Mid level game here, I think uh, Mr. Violetta is about level six. Six it is. And uh, a lot of things to note on this map. Uh, the huge fuel on the right side and being connected to that fuel is usually key to winning this map I find makes things a lot easier especially for taking oh we have weapon support going up by um, by a lot of very uh, very tricky could be a big surprise it's a fairly large map, and I find uh, he, he probably would really rather have three engineers if he's going to do the start just for capping power. Yeah, their friend Harris actually has three engineers and making a four. So ah, I'm starting to get a feeling. We've seen this strat before. Let's see if we can put it together today. American player is going to try and lock down that right side as well it's starting to look like and Mr. Harris needs to get moving move move my little friendly pioneers move move you sexy beast you go get them super packs now we're just cap 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 capping away and MG is on its way for Bit of a surprise, I think, on the left. See, maybe all these pioneers, maybe they'll put on the ultimate flank. Oh, wait a second. Well, that is getting a little crazy here and thinking maybe this middle is going to be important. But it's not the middle on this map, peoples. It is not the middle. Setting up an MG here, which... Really, if it was on the right, it would be perfect, but it's not. Second MG come out. So it's really looking like Violet is going to go maybe head over to that left side. Maybe, and cap something. But you can see the capping power difference right now. and uh, Although... Maybe some wire right here, right here, right here. That'd be nice, some wire right in front, but no, okay. We don't need wire. It's a mid-level game, we don't use wire. This MG's not doing anything, this other MG. Okay, let me rephrase that. The mortar, because I can't see animation correctly. It isn't doing very well. First uh, serious engagement here. Violet. Catch your green cover. We still have a fighter squad doing absolutely nothing. Maybe, maybe they already got skirmish. I don't know. Just waiting to put it down. Move this MG up a little bit here. VP push. Yes, and that's exactly what we had in, con in mind here. The quick Krieg barracks. Which, against this, uh, if he gets another MG out here, it could, could maybe be a bit disastrous if he loses his fuel right away. Oh, nice wire right here by Harris. But he's not going to get cut off from there. 
Lots of running around. This other Pioneer squad could be harassing right here. Harassing. Not having tea. Not having tea. They got tea in the bunkers there, but... And uh, I believe we are getting ready for a little bit of Volkspan. And oh my goodness, an uh, MG placement here. Okay, Violetta, really. That is not, not, I guess you're covering here. Wow, well, well, again, level six, you never know. Might have a big cutting plan here. Could be a lot more aggressive with this mortar and MG here, but he's not. Oh, oh, I see. <laughs> so they're really, really hoping to hold this point. But you can see this MG is absolutely doing nothing for coverage. We got flamers over here. Oh, forward HQ. Oh, huh? this could change things a little bit. Could change things a lot. Oh. And instead of uh, retreating, we will die. Die, die, die. Unfortunately, it's just a little late. And now, Harris come out. Double strike squad. Perfect. No counter at all, because Violetta does not uh, have a clue what's going on here. And what's he? Oh my goodness, he back to. Oh no, he back to the barracks. A sniper, sniper would have been the key, 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 key point here, man. Again, as you see, that uh, MG bunker, useless. MGs useless and mortars useless. Well, let's see if Mr. Violet is smart enough to notice this forward HQ and get rid of it. Oh my goodness! Double Shrek in the face! In the face, body parts everywhere! Look at this! Woo! Fucking barbecue! Fucking <laughs> just got reversed. Perfect. He does notice this. Might have been smarter to, uh. Might have been smarter to decap uh, the point there so he couldn't reinforce, but. Alas, things happen. Getting vet now, very nice. Not sure if we have anything uh, building in that, yeah. Oh no. Don't lose another flamer squad. Oh yes. Yes, unit preservation. Hmm, it's not helping. And these VPs aren't really that important right now, being that you're even. It's very nice to get, uh, what's that, 260 manpower just knocked off right there. Doesn't really counter-react uh, the two flaming squads he just lost. Again, this cut up on the right would really do him a lot better. Maybe move that MG into that house over here. And then have a mortar to back you up. But really, the, the point on the right is... Uh, Really what he should be worried about. Oh, well maybe we're gonna have a little base rush here. I can see that one. Five kills, uh what else? And capping under fire. At least he didn't lose that squad. At least. Nice little cut off. Oh, quick bars. Okay. Well maybe he does have a game plan here. Those flamers are good. Oh, and not only that, we have vet, vet one, vet one, blah 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 blah. Infantry and uh, special units, which I can't remember what that is right now. But he's cut off by the American. Still, this mortar hasn't fought, shot fired once yet. And it's, it's pretty painful, actually. Oh, but of course, oh, finally another MG squad. Sniper would really be more suggestible, I think. And the half track, very nice. I've been watching this a little bit the uh, last game I did. Uh, that was a nice surprise. 
Oh my goodness! Violet's MG finally being useful. Oh my goodness! Harris, what are you doing? No! But he's fine. He's fine because he's cut off. Hey, look at them. Pretty little Panzer Shrikes. I want one. Do it all he can. See how his rifles are attacking right here? That's very nice. Jeez. Grenade right here should be nice, but I don't think he's got enough munis for that. And these MGs, as you can tell, are starting to be a pain in the ass. It'd be really nice if they were using that mortar, but oh well. Just like me. Don't worry about it. Oh, and uh, here comes that third squad of Volks. Um, mines right now would be really handy, but they're not here. Red cover. Oh, I hope he doesn't have sticky bombs. Harris getting ready for his next attack. Oh my goodness, did the mortar team move? Ten minutes in, it's ready to roll. Supply yard up now by Violet, very nice. Oh! In your face. Start to set up a flank, very nice. As you see with that MG over here. No mines. They're pretty useless. And of course it's not set up in the right spot. At this point in time, you should be thinking of diverting all your shit to one side because he obviously has. MG firing, nothing serious. Yeah, oh, good thing you built that mortar squad. Oh boy. Nice. And I'm pretty sure we're going to lose the MG now. Well, getting vet too. It's pretty awesome considering everything's dead. Everything's dead. Well, except this MG that uh, really hasn't done much. And this Pioneer Squad that... Well, he's just... He's, he's got the coffee pot out. He's just checking things out. And yeah. Yeah, suddenly the map control's all... Leading Harris's way here. Be nice to see him maybe recap that mortar with uh, maybe a pile squad or something. Still got one or two around. What else do you guys think? Nothing too serious. He's got his main fuel back. Americans haven't had fuel the whole game. And oh, well, Rangers it is. And we're building something else. Let's have a look. What are we building there? We're building crack. We're not building anything. So I'll have a look here. Oh, M8 coming out. Hopefully he's going to put armor skirts on this. Oh, and now he's decided maybe this part's important. Have a little barbecue. Can't get that MG to fire there. It's unfortunate. No armor skirts. That isn't the right way to play. Oh, and better yet, we will blob a point because that is effective. 
But they did kill him. Let's see, Harris is coming over with his double vet squads, and then he smartly remembers that MG's there, I'm sure. And cover that other point. Oh, and did I say somebody grabbed that mortar? Good job. And do you notice he's got vet one on this mortar? Hmm. How did he get vet one? Did he kill somebody? I don't think so. Still Greyhound. No armor skirts, so no upgrades. That's unfortunate. Combined arm speed. Oh, yeah. Already. Already for the win? Yeah, it's already for the win, right there. Drops a bazooka. And better yet, just run into the fire because you don't die like that. Oh my goodness. Painful to watch. It'd be really nice to see that M8 head to the right side right now, but it's not. It'd be really nice to see this engineer put maybe a mine up or something. Mines are good. Remember? Mines are good. And because we've seen no tanks whatsoever, we are building AT guns. Because we're going to need AT guns after we lose this squad of Rangers. Supply upgraded right now. Did we lose both of the rifle squads? Really? Really? Maybe that's where we got that level fat shit. Well, here's running into a little bit of problem, but now he's got three squads of Grand Spet 2, some Pioneers. Uh oh. Harris. You might want to move that half track before it's absolutely useless. There you go. Oh, oh, and our armor car is upgrading the 50 cal. Really nice. Oh. Stoosh. I believe we have blitz. Is that, is that a stoo or stug? Watch a stug. Nice damage. And that is what happens when you rush tanks into... Uh, now he's got some support. Support is good. But uh, you're going to see how useless the M10 is without armored scares. Did I say that out loud? Nice job with the MG here getting ready for cover. Try to get that stew out of the way. Very nice. Oh, that on the tanks now. Holy moly, he's got bad everywhere. <sighs> Be a good time. Oh, Rangers avoid uh, avoid the nade. If they were smart, they'd fire up and kill the stew. You would turn your AT gun and kill the stew. You would kill the stew. And. You would run away rangers away. Doing some good stuff here. Of course, he's got no support for that uh, AT gun, so he's probably going to lose that too. He's going to get a rear shot, yeah. Unfortunately, that rear shot kind of hurt. If he's smart, he'd move that AT gun into the cover of that MG in that building over there. But it's dead. Well. Shit happens, right? It always does to me in this game. So now what? Yeah. Uh, oh, sending out a uh, two-man two MG. That's that's never the smartest thing in the world. Let's see if he gets it down. Get it down. Get it. Get it down. Let us hear it. Barber? Yes. Piss poor unit selection there. Oh, nice job by Harris. Did some damage with that stew. Picks up, picking up all these things is just, you know, 300 manpower every time. You gotta reinforce. Oh, it's nice if you can do that with maybe piles or 
volts, but when you don't got tier one, you can't be too fussy. You'd actually get more health on that squad, though, via its grins, right? And here comes the Rangers. They're gonna meet the something, I would think. Oh, so we have two squads of Rangers that we're building. Um... Oh. Run, my little Rangers, run before you're suppressed. Oh, nice. Yeah, this is mass carnage here. Oh my goodness. Oh. Not a grenade. But they're still suppressed. Good call by Harris. Get the fuck out of town. Run away, my little wussy boy. Well, this game is pretty much over, I think. It was a little while ago. Paletta just lost too much stuff, couldn't recoup, and wasn't using it effectively to start with. And uh, I think two snipers instead of the barracks and riflemen, probably, of course, you'd have to uh, use it quite well. And a little more retreating on Violetta's part of things, just losing uh, that much manpower all the time. But that's what mid level games are about. See some things that do wrong, and you can laugh about it. Oh, and more rifles because uh, we don't have anything else that we can afford. Nice use of suppression there. It's, it's always nice. So. Well, let's see. What do you think uh, everyone could have done a little better here? I thought Harris did, didn't do too bad. Maybe rush that stew out without. Uh... Oh, this name might do some damage. Yeah, very nice. Could have used that a lot earlier in the game. I'm not so sure why Harris is obsessed with this uh, forward HQ. Because it's not on the side of the map you want to be fighting on. But American has absolutely no munitions. Can't see anything good really coming out of this from here on out. You went infantry company, so I can't say there's gonna be a Calliope to come wreck havoc or airborne. Not well, airborne's useless anyway, unless you're good. I'm not. I'm just gonna probably leave it there. It's 22 minutes. Well, what the hell? Let's see what more big blob can do. And we're gonna get five rifles, right. and perhaps. Perhaps the Stug, the Stug will come and decide what's going on. No AT for that Stug, but you don't need AT. You can just use rifles. But I really think uh, Valetta would have set uh, his gear up on the right side at the start of this game. I could have been pretty difficult, I think. Or at least that might have been the smarter play. Now we're all rushing to the right side, and now all the VAT 2s are rushing to the right side. And uh, I don't really know what the Americans are going to really do here. Oh, Prop War! Very nice, very nice. Yes. That's, that's how we do it. You got MGs, uh, 43s, Panzer Shacks. Eating up the rifles. Yes. I don't think the stew was a bad idea, but I really would have rather saw a medic bunker on the right side, maybe over by the fuel close to his base. You know, he didn't. He could have had snipers, but his micro wasn't going to be good enough to hurt you. 
Still well played. Got something else building in here. It'd be nice if it was maybe. Maybe Harris got maybe uh, what should I call it there? No, he's making another stew. Okay, well, at this point in the game, it doesn't really matter what you build because. <laughs> well, <laughs> apparently we can build a tank depot, so maybe there's something more to this game yet. Besides bad micro. For Mr. Violetta. But no supply upgrades, no triage. No, re no retreating at a good time. Holy cow! Yeah, that's got a six kill mortar. That's he must have killed the whole rifle squad with that. That's sweet. Oh, prop war. Oh, <laughs> uh, yes, I love using prop war myself. Oh, I forgot to say that early on in the game, they had got that munition uh, outpost pumped up. Never did get taken down, that's always nice. Always find them starving for munis as uh, warm up. Uh, this one, uh, I'm not sure why he's doing that. You got your plus 18, you, you might as well get this plus 10 instead. You basically own the map anyways. Americans are basically, yep, let's go have a little party in the American base. I like that idea. Got a little bit on each side. It would really suck if he got hit by Artie right now, don't get me wrong, but you haven't seen one mine all game, so. <laughs> well, oh, 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 nice. Little firestorm. GG. Alright. <laughs> Very well done. Nice job, Harris. Like, like your idea there. Oh. And what better to bring against everything here is a croc. No, it's the crocs doing no damage because they're on cover. <laughs> Good stuff. Oh, and a ranger squad because there's so much shit lying on the ground right now. Ah, well, I have to say that was fun.